in line with our operation last September 16, 2022, wherein we implemented a search warrant for violation of the e-sabong. On September 20 at around 3.41 p.m., Congressman Arturmo Tevez, together with a certain Mr. Tomasino Cabase Aledro, alias Tokoy, and their entourage arrived at the NBI office. The opening statement of Congressman Tevez to me was that he was not connected to Isabong activities and that he had already delegated that to his friends. He then proceeded to ask me who authorized the operation, which I told him it was our director, in line with the order of our president to stop all isabong activities. I told him, frankly, that the said area, the said cockpit which we raided, was not even registered under the PAGCOR. I was then surprised of his re response to me, which he told me that he will sue my, me my men for stealing 7 million pesos at the cockpit. He continued to say that he will spare me from the case if I make it negative of any incoming operations against Isabung. I just laughed because I told him, you cannot, you cannot tell me to betray my oath as a law enforcement officer. You just follow the rules, you follow the order of the president, you follow the requirements, you, fo you just follow it. And I've, I told him frankly, if you want to file the case, you file the case against me, uh, I will answer it because it is not true. I am not afraid. On February 28, 2023, five months after we raided the Isabong operation in Minglanilla, a case was filed against me and my men before the office of the Ombudsman for Visayas for irregularity in the service of search warrant and from fabricated a story that we stole 9 million cash nidako na from 7 million na himo ng 9 million days before the filing of the harassment suit a video was spread in social media showing showing Splice portions of the CTV footage during the operation. They intentionally omitted the inventory corrected, col conducted by my arresting officers in the presence of their lawyer, as well as the barangay captain and officials of the barangay Kalahuan in Minglanilla, Cebu. After the filing of the harassment case, we filed a press release stating that the National Bureau of Investigation takes exception to the published reports on the alleged abuse in, in the search service of search warrant, robbery, and grave, grave misconduct by the NBI Regional Director and operatives.